Welcome or welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for being here. I do appreciate it. So funny story, I just ordered a new sketchbook. I wanted to have like a small sketchbook. Um, and this is what I got in the mail. So um, it's a lot smaller than what I expected. This is like a two by two inches, so five by five centimeters. And actually that's what threw me off. Because you know how they have like a picture of the product on Amazon or whatnot, whatever website. And it's hard to tell the actual dimensions, right? Everything looks bigger. And I saw five by five in the description. I just assumed automatically it was five by five inches. So it was just, you should have seen my face when I got the package. That was really funny. The size I expected is this one. This is a five by five sketchbook. So as you can see, <laughs> this one is much smaller. But I thought it would be kind of fun to make it as a tiny challenge of filling this whole mini sketchbook this week. Also, it's like an accordion sketchbook, which I thought would be fun to try. And it's watercolor paper. So I might use some watercolor, we'll see. Uh, but yeah, so <laughs> I'm just gonna um, fill the whole thing this week. So my idea for the drawings in the mini sketchbook is to use it. I wanted to do one side with a vertical drawing Oops. like this. So I sketched a drawing of my string of hearts plant. I thought it would be perfect since it's a long stringy plant. And then on the other side, I'm either going to do like a little drawing for each square or a continuous drawing, or maybe, you know, connect each square and I'm going to do it on the horizontal. So I think it will be fun to have just something different on each side. Uh, yeah, so I'm going to start inking the string of hearts. <music> It's already Friday. I don't even know how I got here already. Um, quick checking. Uh, so I've been working on the vertical side of my mini sketchbook. I had outlined the string of pearls and I started inking using um, you know my micron pens and stuff but I figured that was gonna take me forever and so I switched to uh, acrylic paint and acrylic gouache. So I'm, I've decided to do just a, the color version on this side. And then on the other side, I'll probably do more uh, pen drawings. So I'm going to finish that tonight. And then I also wanted to do a new version of my plant portrait of a philodendron I did, I think, was it two weeks ago? I did a version in graphite and then I also did a version in watercolor and colored pencils and I really wanted to do a pen version so I started already with the outline and I need to um, work on the shading and everything in pen but I think I need to get another really fine pen um, which oh well I'll have to go to the art store sometime this weekend <laughs> And then I also started working on the sketch. You probably won't see the lines. It's very light sketch um, of the drawing. It's a smaller version of my biggest drawing I did. I did a month ago now, maybe. And my parents really liked the drawing. They asked me if I could send it to them, but it's really, really big and they live overseas. So I've decided to draw a slightly smaller version and uh, and also I wanted to make it better. I wasn't 100% satisfied with the version of the large drawing, so yeah. 
uh, yeah so right now I'm gonna go ahead and finish my string of hearts plant uh, painting and I'll go from there <laughs> So last night I finished uh, inking every drawing in my mini sketchbook. So um, here we go. I didn't end up filming the whole inking process because I started at the coffee shop and I didn't have a tripod to have like an overview, um, like a view from above. So and then I got home and I kind of got in the zone and I didn't film. so. Um, but yeah, I'll show you a close up. I didn't really add any background on those I could have. I didn't want to ruin it, but um, I'd like to try, you know, layering things to get more depth. And, and then the other side is the vertical uh, string of hearts. So I thought it was kind of difficult to, to um, illustrate, but so that was kind of a fun little challenge to do this week. I enjoyed uh, practicing different shadings in pen. So yeah, I think I'll take you along the rest of my Sunday, maybe even tomorrow morning. See how it goes.
So I just got home from a little morning excursion to the coffee shop and the art store. They didn't let me film in the art store. I guess they changed their rules just recently. Uh, but I did get a few things. I got a new black colored pencils and then a couple of those Windsor and Newton fine liner, which I, I tried at the store and they, I like the way they glide on paper. So I'll try them for my next drawing. And then I got some matte medium, which I'd like to try combine with graphite and fine liner. I'll show you maybe next week or soon what I want to do with that. <laughs> and yeah, I didn't get to finish this drawing yet. Um, it's taking a while, but I'll keep working on it, you know, this coming week. But in the meantime, uh, it's already Monday and I need to edit this video. So I'm going to close the vlog here. Thank you so much for watching, especially if you watch till the end. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Please subscribe, comment, share it with your friends, and I'll see you next week with a new vlog. Bye.